welcome back to another BitLife video. I haven't done one in a while, and I actually wanted to revisit the Wheel Decides My BitLife Challenge, because I failed miserably the first time. I would like to do better this time, and that's my plan. I don't know how well it's gonna go, but I had to rewatch my video to remember what I got because I didn't feel like spinning the wheel again until I succeed in the requirements from the first life that failed miserably. The only difference is my character's name is different from that first attempt. And same with the family members. Other than that, the country is the same and we're gonna follow everything that I got from the first time, but we're gonna do a better job at it, per se. And I'm just gonna play BitLife normally until we reach a certain point, and we'll just go on from there, and I'll follow my requirements as we go. But yeah, anyway, let's go ahead and start. Our character's name today for this challenge is Claudia Zhu. Or Zhu. I don't know how to pronounce the last name. I'm sorry if it was kind of offensive. But anyway, we have a mother and a father and no pets. So the parents can give us either one to five pets or we manually have to go to a adoption center and adopt them. The wheel I spun it said I can go anywhere to adopt. But anyway. Let's continue. Your parents want to buy you and your little sister a pet cat named Bailey. Sweet, we got one pet. I can either get four more pets or stay with the one. Although I don't know once the pets die, it actually still kind of counts. Your classmate Joyce tells you every day that your face is just punchable. Reporter, Mr. Ong gave Joyce lunch detention. Finally, every time I tell on a bully, they don't do anything. Your cat barely died at the age of 12. Oh, Well, we can always adopt another pet if I really want one. Roundhouse kick his jaw, I guess. Damage, oh, that's a lot. I didn't get in trouble, though. You got a baby boy, your new brother, Lee. Cool. And no one wants to become friends. We're not old enough to date yet, I don't think. Oh, yes we are. He rejected me. Oh boy. Okay, we graduated from secondary school. I ruled a music major for college, but I also got business CEO, which both of those don't really match. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. We also got to start dating. We need 15 to 30 lovers. Ah, oh, that's gonna be hard. Shen Shen. That's one lover, I guess. You graduated from uni with an undergraduate degree in music. Cool. Oh, he's asking me to lose my virginity. Um, I can't have kids. Well, if we get pregnant, we have to get an abortion. You told your boyfriend Shane that it's important to wait until marriage. He said he understood, but he started crying. Oh, I feel bad, but this is what I got from a wheel decider. It wasn't my decision. Job referral. Your boyfriend Shane has a friend who works at Adams Automotive and can get you a job there. We can work there temporarily. We need another lover. I feel like the lovers and then the job might be harder. Everything else seems a little easier. Would hooking up count for the lovers? Okay, I played a little bit off recording. All I've been doing is one night stands and the boyfriend broke up with me. Well, that was a load of shit. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. Six out of 30. We at least need 15. So we're gonna keep on doing this. Oh, yeah. Oh no, I picked the wrong option. Thank God we didn't get pregnant or anything. Anyway, let's keep going. Oh yeah, we gotta get a job. I got fired from that. I don't qualify for business CEO, so we gotta go with retail or a junkyard person as an alternative. And we got the job, cool. 
Oh goodness, that is a lot. I think the hookup thing is working and it's probably the safer route. Unless my person had a boyfriend already. <laughs> but she's single now, so it's safe. But anyway, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We got eleven lovers. Well, quote unquote lovers. Li Zheng. Sure. We're just trying to accomplish 15 to 30. So the boyfriend. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Ex boyfriend is dead? He would be 13. So we at least need two more. Break up, I kind of figured. Well, I got 15 lovers. We need... Oh god, I need to pay attention to the money. And the lifespan. Okay, I played a lot off recording. I was stuck in prison for a while because I hired a quote-unquote hitman to, like, kill my person's husband. What? What the fuck? It didn't end well, but I'm finally out of there. And now, I don't know what I'm gonna do for the year. Money? Because my person got arrested, so she can't get a job. But we do have a lot of lovers. Exes, rather. I think this life is going somewhat better. But I just need at least reach age of 70 and then get two million dollars. I don't know how I'm gonna get the two million, but we're gonna try. Ow! No! I died! Oh, we got 16 lovers. We did a better job this time. I will say, um, I think when I spun the wheel, I got the most challenging one. I think the main issue was the college major and then the job, because what I got didn't match. But yeah, Claudio was beaten to death at the age of 68. Oh, I do not make it to age 70, god damn it. A troublesome lady, she studied music at university. Claudia worked as a janitor for many years since a business CEO was definitely not a requirement for the music industry. I will say, the job, the money, and the lifespan, I failed, but everything else I passed. So I will consider this as a successful run, I guess. But yeah, anyways guys, thank you all so much for watching. If you want me to do another Wheel Decides My Bit Life challenge, feel free to let me know. And yeah, I guess I'll see you all next time in another Bit Life video. Or whatever I make next. Goodbye for now.